hey beauties welcome back to my channel my name is Nelly here if you are new in this channel or you're just coming across for the very first time you're welcome please feel free to subscribe to the channel make sure you turn on the notification bell for more videos and to my returning subscribers you know that Nelly had to thank you for your amazing support none is taken for granted so guys without further ado let's dive in into today's video guys today's video is a reaction video I just finished watching some videos on youtube and uh, today i want to talk about this and i want to react to this video because this thing is really getting too much they said too much of everything is bad um that is this guy this uh jamaican guy that uh, have made so many videos about d wango and i am Ma i am mawa uh, that is d wango's elder brother like defrauding him of six thousand ux dollar of course is a huge money is a huge amount of money and uh and I see in so many the, the people that reacted on this video, I see the Wango and the brother Ayamawa, you know, coming to attack the people. Just sending this and the Wango, I'm sending it as a message, okay? They said too much of everything is bad. I don't know the reason why this, you know, you to this whitey street. Anywhere you put head is you and uh, Ayamawa and uh, the Wango. It's too much. It's not only two of you that is on this YouTube, like on this YouTube street, right? According to your word, you people are, or whatever, you people are big YouTubers. There is no doubt. But I don't know how many people, when people, whenever people react on you people, you know, react on your videos, two of you always come back to attack that particular person. We are reacting. It is a it, reaction is a niche in, on YouTube. Okay, you can't stop, and you can't stop. You know, people that have taken reactions as their niche, like because you know by coming to attack them. Anybody that says something about you, the next thing is for you to come in this comment section and start writing. So there's something you can be bigger than. Do you understand? How many of big YouTubers and you are not the only big YouTuber we have on YouTube, right? There's people that are bigger than you. For instance, our our brother Wodemaya. Wodemaya for now, as far as I am concerned, I think he is the biggest YouTuber like on YouTube that we know from this uh, in African community with one point one point something million subscribers people have been bashing on Wiremaya. people have been saying all sorts of insult and all the rest of it for you know throwing at Wiremaya. but you can never in any place or in any comment section you see what the maya coming to attack the person or see whether this is youtube okay everybody have the right to end his view or her view People don't talk about what is happening. This is social media. Of course, if any any of you doesn't want, if any of you doesn't want reaction on your videos, then you start you start doing the right thing. Any place a baby is crying and pointing, check very well. You must see either the father is there or the mother is there, and which is correct. You can't tell me that somebody will always come out. You know, every time. People are coming out to, you know, to accuse you people in one thing or the other. Okay, it's not much you come to write, question, write uh, this thing. There's some things you will see, you overlook. As a big YouTuber you are, right? I am not here to come and react on the business between you and the, the Jamaican guy did that is causing all this katakata. How on earth can you even come on somebody's platform to leave a comment that if she did not take video that she took her time to make the video she reacted on to, if she don't pull it, she should not pull that video down that you are going to pull that in the channel down for what why will you threaten a reactor somebody you know that is, is a she's a reactor why will he say is she she you know she and her view she speak what well, somebody reached out to her what crime did she commit by coming out to to create it as a content because the guy reached out to her and gave her gave her a, a, a permit to go ahead to make video about it this is to tell you that this guy is is in pain that this guy and this guy particular guy we are talking about has released so many evidence which you came like you are making it to before people were doubting could this be true we we, we don't even know who to believe but you coming to uh, 
uh, African Beauty TV to threaten her to remove that account number and which means that guy and D1 go indeed they did a, there's a transaction between them. You have come to let people know that that account count is really D1 goes account. So there is definitely something that is a transaction between these two people. My people, let's be doing, let's be nice for the for one another. And in this life, nobody knows tomorrow. What they said, what goes around turns around. However, you lay your bed, so you will lie on it. Don't think that you can shut people up, or maybe you can threaten people because you are a big YouTuber, or maybe you can you can treat people anyhow you want, you know, because you are one thing or the other, and the, you want to surprise them, or you they because of you they they cannot air their view. No, things are not done like that. Listen, let me tell you, in this life, I am not fully coming into to react on what is happening or what has transpired between you and uh, your sister D Wango and the Jamaican boy. But what I'm saying is, stop threatening people, okay? These people that you are threatening to bring down their, their channel down, they are content creators. Someone reached out to them. If anyone did not reach out to her, she will not come and make video about it. And the guy himself, you people are, you know, you people put in that condition. Also think the condition you have, you know, if if really what that guy is saying has happened, no matter what has transpired between this guy and D1 go, and if really what this guy is saying is true, it's both of you that knows the truth and only God that knows what is true. I want to let you know that money is not everything, okay? You see, one day all of us will you know, we die and live the same money. Like, there is nothing like good name. They said good name is better than riches, okay? If really that what that guy is saying is true, I think my advice for you and um, for you, uh, Amawa and D1 go, go and settle this guy. You people should do this business in amicably. Settle this guy so that he can be free and also you guys will be also be free because whatsoever that goes around surely turns around. You don't know what tomorrow will be. So that is my you know that is my quick advice to both of you stop threatening people these people are content creators you can't stop people reacting if you don't want people to react then do the right thing or you leave the youtube as far as you continue to do things people have the right to react on what is not right okay reaction is allowed on youtube so stop threatening people Stop threatening people. This is my first time I am reacting like on your video and I'm reacting it because it is too much. I hardly speak in this manner. Okay? Go and sort out with that guy. This is not time you will intimidate someone and they, it will go, the person will go free. No, as far as social media is concerned, social media is the medium that is so powerful. Someone that cannot speak for himself or herself to speak. If he can, if somebody cannot speak for himself, social media is the only way to you know to to for people to speak for that person so my amawa and d wango my peaceful advice to you make sure you propose sort out with that jamaican guy if there is any business that have transpired between both of you go and sort it out for the sake of life destiny and eternity this life we are not dwelling in this life forever okay there must be a day you will come before your maker and you will give account of all that you have done. Despite all the money, so many people that you have seen that have gone, that has money, where are they? Did they go with the money? So never you allow money issue to be to be a hindrance to la your life and destiny. So this is, I am not here to judge anyone, no, but this is just like a message, not really reaction, but just like a message to uh, Amawa and Diwango. Take it easy. Take it easy. This platform is too big to contain many of us, okay? There are people that are bigger than you people. They don't make noise. When people react on their videos, why must you come and attack pe reactors, people that are reacting on your video? Are you the only person? No. So I'm so sorry maybe if I sound anyhow, I am Maru, I am Mawa and the Dinwango, but this is the, 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 the painful truth. I am just saying, is only person that can speak out that knows where i am heading to will understand why i am speaking in this manner if there is anything between you and this jamaican person this jamaican guy 
I advise you people to go and sort it out and settle it amicably for the sake of life and eternity. So that is my peaceful advice to you. Guys, I'm going to end it here as I sign out to see you in my next one. Feel free to end your view in my comment section. I will definitely get back to you. Stay blessed.